I wanted to take away poutine tonight. I went on foot, got lost. Poutine. Poutine. And now everything's written weird. Fuck, I'm way too far. The St. Petersburger Poutine in Russia. I'm now in the first class area of cheeses. Everything's written in Cyrillic, but I get that these are not local cheese. Since I don't want a brie from France, I have to move. I'm going to sort the fries first. Fucking fast food. I try another corner shop and hidden away, I find Fisello like Russian cheese sticks. I'm not super confident about it, but I'll make a duck face. For the sauce and the meat, I'll put my confidence on a borscht from a stolovaya. Borscht is the common Eastern European beetroot soup, and stolovayas are the super tasty Russian cafeterias. First step, put the caviar on the side. Open the blin, the crepe. Crepes are big in Russia. Dump the fries inside. Put back the caviar on top. Grab a bit of the meat from the borscht. Open the weird cheese sticks. Realizing it's like caulk and I can't even split it with my hands. A little sauce, and it's ready. I have to say the Russians like their borscht and their blend with caviar. A poutine in a crepe, it's genius. The St. Petersburger poutine. One crepe, what the fuck? Pink salmon caviar. Chichil, it's an Armenian cheese made to accompany beers. I approve of this. Fast food fries. Ketchup, what the fuck? That was a blatant mistake. The solid parts of a beetroot soup. The borscht. Taste, 7 on 10. Yes, it was good. Is it a poutine? 3 out of 10. I've lost the plot on this one, but a poutine and a crepe? It should be a thing. And as a bonus, the holy St. Petersburger poutine. The crepe stays. Russian cheese, dvorug. You need Russian potatoes. Sturgeon caviar. Beef gravy with beetroot. Borscht Remix 2.0.